and claim that I beat them up and everything are, are moving out. They put their stuff in a truck and they claim they'll be gone by Wednesday. Uh, I have the option to try to put the, get the case back on the calendar to ask the judge, but I don't think I can get a notarized letter saying they've moved out. And if I do that, it'll advance the case, and I don't really want to do that. And, uh, you know, it's, I can't go home. Patriots crying and freaking out and weak and sick and and shell-shocked, and the watchers are tormenting her horribly with the voice to skull, with the, uh, you know, they start out with nice, with the nice story, oh, we understand, it's okay, we have sympathy, and they end up saying, throw them in jail, put away the key, and they go to housing court, put them in jail, and they just, they torment her day and night with these voices, like schizophrenia, and, and it's taking a toll on her, and she's, she's weak and tired, and I'm, I'm actually sick. I think I may be getting the flu or something. Or it's possible I opened my laptop to try to fix the screen that was broken and the billions of Morgellons, uh, you know, things that are in there jumped on me and that could be why I'm getting really sick. But whatever it is, I'm getting really sick and if I don't manage to get better, we're gonna be really fucked because, you know, I gotta try to hire some people to help her pack. I don't know who to hire. We don't have that much money. We don't have anywhere to go yet. But thank God we have some money to pick a place, find a place if we can find one. But somebody told me that Mercury's going into retrograde, so we shouldn't expect any place stable for a few months. And I don't know what to do. We may have to just put everything in storage, or if you know, if, if the Creator blesses us and things work out, then maybe everything will work out. I don't know. Um, I just got an offer from a woman in, in uh, I think in Holland to consider going there and trying to heal I, that fascinates me, I love the idea I really don't know what to think or if it's even possible um, I, I don't really know what we're going to do, I'm trying my best not to panic and it's really hard I, I'm losing it losing my temper, I'm losing my humility, I'm, I'm forgetting to be humble, I'm, uh, it's so hard, uh, uh, anyway, um, so that's the deal, Patriots freaking out, we got until Friday, the people, all they have to do is just claim that Patriot said something to them about me, or that I talked to them, or whatever, and I could be put back in jail, even though I didn't do anything to them. Um, it's like possibly the building is rent controlled, and then the landlord is ready to have the new tenants because the neighborhood is gentrifying and the rents are, you know, what the market will bear, and so people like us are get out and got a couple of days to do it. Usually I'm the one who like jumps and shoves everything in boxes because Petra gets too freaked out and she starts like looking at every little thing and and I'm like please Petra just shove it all in boxes and we'll deal with it later please. You know I don't even I, I'm I'm just gonna have to trust in the Lord that whatever happens happens because they've done it this time. They've been trying to do this the whole time the watchers you know, take all our stuff and leave us homeless in the street and freaking out and sick and dying and, and it's finally happening. This this whole false allegations and winding in jail really taught me that uh, this is not a nice place and these are not nice people and uh, even though we were very nice and did everything they wanted, they still did this to us. It was completely unnecessary. They were moving out. We were happy to move out. We 
told them so. They did it anyway. So something's going on here, you know. And and the sicker I get, and the worse I look, you know, the less people want to deal with me, you know, because they're afraid or something. I don't know. Maybe the mind controllers or whatever. I don't know what it is, man. People are people are different. Um, but there are those of you who are also experiencing this, and I pray for all of you. Uh, there may be a solution to this technology uh, based on, it's based on some kind of spin relaxometry, according to Dr. Duncan. That was my theory, too, some kind of scalar particle spin uh, heating up the molecules to the next state and as they drop down you get information and just one of the many many technologies and tools anyway uh, somebody was asking me about a donate button and I did put one on our page but somebody else was telling me I'm a scumbag scammer and so you know you can't win um, thank you all for praying for me and for us and I pray for everyone that that suffers. Thank you for your time. And I'll try to make more videos. Thank you. <laughs>